Hi everyone, this is Juliana and I just have a very quick video. I want to share with you a couple of um, my clay embellishments that I've created. And um, I used to be very involved with clay. I used to do a lot of clay accessories and beads and things like that um, before I did um, scrapbooking. And uh, I haven't done anything with clay in a very, very long time, but I really do enjoy it. Um, it just takes a little bit of time, but um, I really like it. And I just recently watched a video by Sally, and she is Miss Mustang 3, I believe, and I will put her link below. But um, she did a wonderful tutorial on how to make your own, um, your own clay embellishments. So, um, I got very inspired by her video and I decided to try it out the way she was doing it. And I have to say that it was great. Her instructions were perfect. Uh, I had no problem creating these and um, I really loved the results. So, please check out her tutorial. She did an excellent, awesome job explaining. Um, so, I'm just going to show you a couple of the ones that I created. Um, as many of you know, I love to collect vintage jewelry, and I had a lot of couple pieces that I could use. So, um, these are some of them. So, I'll show you this one. Isn't this gorgeous? I just love, love the color and the texture. And this is from a vintage jewelry piece that I had. And um, I made it in gold, too. Isn't that so cute? I just love it and the fact that it's just clay it's like blows my mind because it doesn't look like clay to me um, here's another one and this one kind of chilled out a little bit funky but I really like the style it looks pretty vintage and I would totally use this on a mini album or something like that so I really like that one um, I also made it with this other color so just very very cute and this other one here as well so I um, really really like these um, and then you know you could try to put a key inside um, also I created this one and this is just the two different types of clay that are just mixed together um, and I really like the color and the effect so all I did is I just put like this glimmery um, gloss over it and I didn't want to paint, I just wanted to leave it like that. I really like that. It's pretty chubby chick, I think. Um, and then also created this key. And this key is, uh, it's, it says Journey over here. I think it's by Tim Holtz. And yeah, it didn't turn out perfect. But, you know, I really like the, the uniqueness of it and the style. So I think it would look really cute as an embellishment. Um, and then I also created this one. I really love this. It's like a nice pretty flower. And I also made it in gold. Just like that. So super cute. Just love these pieces. And I can't wait to create some more. Um, then there's also this piece. Um, this piece came like that with this hole in the middle. Um, it's really kind of weird, but I really like it. It's very different. And what I did is I made another one in gold and I put this embellishment in the metal and look at how pretty that is isn't that so cute I just love it I'm uh, seriously I would put this in anything that is like vintage or you know any type of project so there is that one um, also created this one and I really really like it and in the metal you can put an embellishment also like a flower center and um, I made a sample with this one. And this one I use um, crackle medium. So I crackle it and then I put one of those little flower centers from Prima. I really love how it turned out. And this is just another way of doing it with something in the metal. So there you go. I just really love them. And I wanted to experiment with the leaf. So here's my leaf. I really love how it turned out. Super cute. It would look so perfect with the flower there, or um, you know, even like something like this, maybe something like that would be kind of cute. 
or something like this but you can also use you know any just any regular flower um, and lastly I made some cameos so love cameos look at this one isn't that so pretty and I also made this other one I just love them I love these pieces and um, there's another one and I mixed two colors there together and also made this piece here which you really can't tell but there's supposed to be a rose in the middle but I just like I love the color and um, it will look cute has an embellishment too so that's it you guys I just wanted to share with you a couple of the pieces that I've been creating um, of clay and really want to um, let you know to, to just check her video she does a very great tutorial on this um, oh, and very quickly, here's a little tiny flower, too, that I created. Isn't that gorgeous? So, so pretty. But, yeah, let me know uh, what you guys think of this. And I hope everybody's having a great Tuesday. I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, and also, um, at the end of this clip, I will have some pictures um, of while well, I was working on it. So you get to see a little bit of the process and the results. So please stay tuned for that. Bye-bye.